Thanks, Christiana. It is 746. Hamdipa Devi is back with us. But instead of demonstrating kind of a DIY project like yeah. she typically does, she is sharing the top trends in kitchen and bath design and remodeling. You just got back from a really big show in Vegas. What yes. was it called? It was KBiz, uh, the kitchen and bath industry show, and also the builder show and the national hardware show was all combined. Oh, my goodness. Huge. What was the biggest thing that you learned? What's the biggest trend of 2023? So in kitchen bath, I would say urban and natural is in gold is a huge trend navy was a big trend as well and there was just uh so much electronic and technology that was really infused into most things that you use daily so we're going to show you some pictures because yes. debbie you were busy you snapped a lot of photos <laughs> and got a lot of really cool video okay so what is this so this is like for a blind corner cabinet this is something that uh will make it much easier than crawling all the way in there this is a leather front refrigerator um, and then once you pull all that out then you get more access to the unit instead of having to crawl all the way in there, which makes it a lot more accessible and a lot more efficient for your kitchen. Huh, that's really interesting. So, so now we've got what? Is this a leather? This is leather a leather fridge? front fridge huh. with a black charcoal interior, which was so beautiful. And this is new. Uh, we just passed through it was a 48 inch French door refrigerator. This is LED and platinum interior. Um, there's so many cool things. One of the really cool things now, uh, this is bespoke from Samsung where you can change the panels. This oh, you can get so your unique. custom art, your family photo, anything you on want your on your fridge. <laughs> uh, this is a uh, range that you could get sous vide in, steam in. Um, these components right here go right in your countertop so you don't have a whole unit and it makes it much more efficient to clean around whether you have electric or gas. I've never seen that so you don't have that big square thing. Correct, it just goes right oh. in, uh, mounted right into your countertop. So it really makes it nice. All these things are made, meant to make your life easier and more luxurious. This is LED front panels from LG. It's so high technology, but you can make your fridge any color you want all year round and then also put it to music. So it's really Ooh. fascinating oh what they can do right now. So from the kitchen to the bath, we're talking about faucets and shower yes. heads. So is this a shower head? This is a shower head, a rain shower head combined with a light. And so it really gives you the luxury. And this is a tub that has steam and a waterfall. Um, gold was huge in faucets and all types of accents. Um, gold is back with a vengeance, but more brush gold. This one is uh, a shower massage system horizontal. So you build your quartz uh, around it, you lay down and the rain comes oh down goodness. and massages, massages you. You can see all the gold accents, and this is where they're bringing kitchen components to the bathroom with a pull-out faucet and a wave function so you don't have to touch it, less germs and more cleanability. So there's just so many different wonderful things that you could really enhance your life with. So is white out as far as cabinets go? You know, white is a transitional color. I feel like white is a classic that is forever, but right now it's still in, but kind of trending out but i would say you know you could always have white cabinets and be fine but you're seeing some black matte cabinets black matte cabinets and white with chrome trim and uh navy is huge gray is kind of definitely on its way out as well okay gray is out that's on my whole house is gray oh well that's okay <laughs> well sure. great cabinets. great cabinets I okay say. and are people still doing the mix and match yes so uh two-tone is still very big you know lighter on the perimeter darker on the island so or light, darker on the base and lighter on the uppers so that's kind of a trend as well you want to make sure you know gray is still in white is still Still in but now we're bringing in all the naturals with it so whether you have gray or browns everything neutral is going to combine and be cohesive and just look beautiful together okay so it's okay if you have gray at home too just change a little bit just a little paint or like a little little pops here pops there oh, add some 100%, neutrals in and you yeah. can kind of 
be more on trend? It's very neutral, so it'll <laughs> still coordinate with everything. Okay. Debbie, thanks so much for giving us some uh, cool ideas and trends uh, for yep. what we can expect with kitchen and bath. She's going to stick around. She's got another segment with Whitney coming yeah. up where she's going to talk a little bit more about some of the cool features at that big show. But speak, speaking of Gianna. Okay, so we have Home Depot Debbie back at this hour showing yep. us some of the cool things she just discovered at the annual kitchen and bath industry show in Sin City. And I still have like food in my mouth from that last segment, so I'm sorry, Debbie. <laughs> but we're, we're happy to talk to you about this. What fun. Yes, these are more some more novelty items. This is brand new in fireplaces. This is a vertical spiral, uh, spiral fireplace, hmm. a U-shaped fireplace that kind of encompasses your TV, which, you know, you have to have a very large space for this, but it was really cool um, to see the, the creativeness that you could do with. Um, and this is a vapor fireplace. It's made with water underneath and lights, so there's no heat though. So it's great for Arizona that you could have it all year round and it runs on electricity and vapor. So yeah. what, you know, there, really interesting. There are very few months out of the year when we actually need a fireplace, exactly. but it's nice to have kind of the glow. Right, and the electric ones that you could turn the heater off and this vapor one um, are perfect for here in Arizona. So this is what's coming new probably in the fall. And you kind of got a little taste of luxury. You were telling <laughs> us about this. What is it? It's a, it's a towel, something that heats your towels. So it is a heated, uh, towel a glass that is put you could put a piece of art on it they have uh, ones to choose from from heat storm and it is available on homedepot.com and you can choose which one you want and hang it as a piece of art hang it in your bathroom you could add a towel bar and it will heat your towels <laughs> as you you know if you want yeah i mean so. i will say like there are very few like cold mornings and cold days but right. that would be like a nice little a little thing to get your morning for sure day even started. when you have the air conditioning running there's nothing wrong with a hot towel <laughs> yeah <laughs> i like the way you think yes. so how how crucial is this these shows for you you go to these shows it's just kind of what to expect you know it's really fun to see that innovation and what's coming like this for example these are hidden doors so they look like shelf units and cabinetry and uh, you can even put your pool cues or whatever and you open it up and there's a hidden room or a closet or your safe or something behind it so it acts as storage you know it's the, you usually see these in mansions and whatnot but <laughs> anybody can have these uh, hidden doors and they look beautiful you'd never know there was something behind it but you know there is Cool, that's so awesome. So much for indoors and outdoors. And then what is this I see, a hidden pool deck? Yes, so this is, if you have, uh, in the interest of compact living and space saving, and you need extra patio space or what have you, this is a deck that goes over your pool, slides back and forth, so when you need living space, you have the deck, and when you don't, then you have uh, your pool. This is really something, um, you know, to just give you double the space, which makes it, you know, excellent yeah. because a lot of times you don't have a lot of land. Yeah. You just have to have the space uh, where the deck can go mm -hmm. when you slide it. Gone are the days of those like plastic pool covers. Do you remember those? <laughs> Getting no. those on and off. Those I mean, you are know. actually still a thing yeah. Yeah. <laughs> um, for insulation yes. and keeping them warm. Okay. But for this, this gives you a hard surface that you can actually, you know, put a table and chairs on or have a party on. Okay, we have about 30 seconds. Anything okay. else you want to you so touch this on that was for, your favorite? Uh, compact living and space saving. This is a double countertop where if you're cooking you slide it you have extra countertop this is a raise up when you have uh, your mixer in the cabinet it comes up when you want compact living is a big thing to give you extra space when you need it sliding walls hidden compartments this is a desk that just pops out of a, a cabinet you know it's a seat and then a countertop for you mm. to sit at as a desk so these are things that if you have a small space, you can maximize your space and have other things that you need, but you just don't have the room for, 
these are what you do. And this is really great. He's just going to sit down. Oh my God, he's going to sit down. So he got you have so a desk, has, you know. <laughs> so <laughs> it could be your desk, it could be your dining table, right. all of the and above. And these are compact vanities. You know, if you really have a small bathroom and you don't want the cabinet to take up the whole room, very high end finishes and very, you know, unique shapes, but you get your vanity in a small, small space where you need it. Look at this. This is an oh. urban uh, little rock and sink. You know, there's so many things you can do for space saving, but that look luxurious and beautiful. Yeah. So you just have to think out of the box and oh. uh, you can find most of this stuff eventually. You know, it's all some of it prototypes, some of it available now, some coming in the fall um, at Home Depot. Okay, that's so cool. So we'll check in on that man sitting at his little, his little desk uh, <laughs> yes. table situation. All right, Debbie, <laughs> thank you so much. Absolutely, thank you. And we will be right back with more Good Morning Arizona.